everybody, it's Lex from PDQ.com. I'm going to take you through auto reports. What is auto reports? Simply put, it's just scheduling reports that you got to do on a regular basis, you know. Once again, I want to take work off your plate, you know. If your boss expects a weekly report, you can do it weekly, monthly, you know. But uh, let's just talk about, uh, run one real quick here. Let's go set up one a monthly report, okay? So let's say you need to be able to show that you are patching your machines on a regular basis. So if you run this monthly and you keep the report in a folder, you know, kind of follows whatever kind of audit you may have to do for keeping machines up to date. So let's just name this auto report. We're going to call this the monthly trigger. And uh, the path, we'll just write this out to a file because you know what? You know, I know where to go get it. So at this point, I'm just going to put it on desktop reports here. I would suggest you put on a file share so you don't have to share your desktop with everybody else. But again, this is a video, so I can get away with it. And then let's just take a look at how you want to name your report. You want to name your report probably with uh, the report name and date. Yeah, that looks. And then I'm going to make sure this comes out in a PDF file format or a CSV if people want that. You can choose that. So triggers. Again, we want this to run monthly. What day of the month do you want it to run? Actually, here you can do multiple days if you want, but let's just say we're going to have this run on the second day of the month. Okay. Now, you can set this up to email, but we've already set it up to run as a file. So let's go select our reports. Now, the report I'm going to select is the applications report because it lists computers and all the applications that are on those. So again, this report, the applications report, is going to run on the uh, second day of the month at 3 p.m. Give that an okay, and guess what? Auto report's done. Now I can open that up, and I can go into reports and add additional reports to that, and each of these reports will get written on their own. Um, so we'd attach, let's say we wanted to do, I don't know, logical disk report with that. So every month we get a, the applications, and then we get the logical disk report. So you can do that. Now, you can do that setup, again, daily, weekly, monthly. It's really that simple. So, again, think about it a little bit. If you have to do this for somebody on a regular basis, automate it and never have to do it again. Hey, I'm watching PDQ.com. Thanks for watching.